What's up everyone, Dave with Concrete, and today we're going to talk about what are the different types of house foundations and how do you know which one you have. This is 3 Minutes of Why with your foundation guy. Okay, so today we're going to talk about how do you know what type of house foundation do you have that's underneath your home that's holding your home up? So this is three minutes of why with your foundation guy. So we're gonna start the timer at three minutes and so we don't go over time. So there's really three main different types of foundation, especially here in the Midwest. The first one is a basement. Most people have heard of a basement. Most people have been in a basement. Most people houses at least around here have a basement. Now, some parts of the country don't have a lot of basements, but most people know what they are. Sometimes a technical term, they can be called a foundation or, you know, a, um, just a, a shelter or something. But a basement is really walls underneath your home that add more space to your house. So you usually go down a set of stairs and you're in a different part of your house where you can stand up, you can walk around in, you might have bedrooms and, and bathrooms and whatnot, and a family room down there. That is a basement. The second type of foundation for a home is gonna be a crawl space. Now a crawl space is like a half basement. Usually the walls are only gonna be about this tall, and to get into a crawl space, usually you gotta duck down or you gotta get on your hands and knees. There are some crawl spaces where you might even have to get on your belly to get through them. Basically what it is, is typically it's a footing with a short wall, sometimes this short, sometimes that, just kind of depends. And then your house is framed on top of those walls. Sometimes there will be a floor poured in there, sometimes there won't. So a crawl space, again, is basically, it's a basement under your home, but it's not a living area. You can't really go and hang out down there. You can't have a bedroom down there. Um, it, and that, again, is kind of a, a different places of the country. You might see a lot more crawl spaces. So East Coast, you're going to see a lot more crawl spaces um, than you would anywhere else. So in the last and not least would be a slab on grade. And a slab on grade foundation is basically just your house. You don't have a basement under it. You don't have a crawl space under it. There's just a floor poured. There's probably going to be some footings poured on each side all the way around your house to hold your house up. And then they'll go and they'll pour a floor over top of your footings. Um, and they might, there might be a little short stem wall or something, you know, or a row of block that they go and put on there. But a slab on grade, there's no place to get underneath your house. So there might be some wiring and whatnot that runs in the floor underneath, but that's, that's usually it. You can't get under. So a basement, you can walk around in, you can live in. A crawl space, you can get in, but you wouldn't want to live in it. You'd have to duck down and crawl everywhere. And a slab on grade, you can't go anywhere underneath your house. It's just a concrete floor. Um, I would highly doubt you'd probably see a dirt floor or anything. Maybe a wood floor. We have seen a couple wood floors, but mainly, mainly just a concrete floor and a slab on grade. So those are the three main types of foundations. So I hope that was helpful. Again, this is Dave with Ep Concrete, and this was three minutes of why with your foundation guy. If you found today's video helpful, please go up and uh, click subscribe and follow us for more videos to come. See ya.